Fuck, my bike. Uh, no. no! Oh, now I'm gonna have to walk for the rest of this game. Ew. Nope. Duff. You gotta burn that. Fuck. Those are like those. Don't, like, eat don't eat it, don't eat it, don't no, eat it, don't eat it, don't eat it. No! She's gonna eat it. She's gonna eat it. like tardigrades, right? What? what? Those little bugs that can fly in the, like, The things space. that can survive, yeah, yeah the they tardigrades. Yeah, they can survive in space. Crypto bite. Crypto bite. Biote. Ew, 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 don't. It's savoring it. Tastes like chicken. Ew. Stop. Why did he do this? <laughs> Art. Wanna come work for me? You're gonna ask that question a lot as you play this. But our implementation team has been decimated. And there's only so much they what can do. What are those? Do. Those monster are monster energy drinks. Yeah, why? What are those doing <laughs> there? Like that's in the future still? They can still fucking make those in the future? They're doing fine. They're fucking brick babies. Things are dying because of the, the rain and they're still fucking drinking monster. Where's the fucking the monster time. factory? They, they have, can still fucking command. make monster energy drink. And they make haven't changed, anything else. They haven't changed their logo else. or their I can design. They just found a crate of those somewhere in the I ruins of old so humanity. So <laughs> I, have a job I bet Hideo found an email saying, we will give you money. We are monster energy drink. Put five of these cans randomly on a futuristic table. That is really hilarious. I love it. I love it. This is a world in which your canteen, instead of dispensing water, it takes in rainwater uh -huh. and converts it into monster energy. You've got a canteen with infinite energy drink monster in it. Energy all drink just, consumed. just a monster energy drink consumed. Stamina restored. And then when it rains, it'll fill back, or if you go in the water, it'll fill back up. And then through some magic process of the canteen, you can cut away from this. Uh, it will convert the water, which by the way, rain in this game is a nightmare, but somehow this canteen will still turn the time fall Ugh. into monster energy drink. Yep, that is accurate. You also, you couldn't be more when right. you're in the private rooms, it is some of the most high-res monster energy can <laughs> artwork I have ever seen. Those cans are glistening and sharp and good, gorgeous. Good-looking good textures. Uh, you also have mechanics and uh, um, bars for your shoes. There's mechanics for everything, man. There's degradation on everything. You also have a mechanic for uh, the BB. Yes, uh, the BB, if it gets too stressed out, you have to soothe it. And if you don't soothe it in time, it will uh, also have a thing where it's like, it just won't work anymore until you get to another private room. Uh, that is the, I think, I forget what it's called, the Odorek? Uh, named after, like, everything in this game. Named after, oh, oh you no. Lost, okay. So, yeah, also, uh, there is there is a height limit <laughs> for some areas. <laughs> it's okay, I'm just picking everything back up. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm uh -huh. Picking everything you back can also up. hold it in your hand. You, you forgot one. Uh, oh, no okay. You're not, just, okay. You know what? I'm just gonna let some <laughs> of this go. <laughs> Mr. Magooing your way through. I'm gonna here. let some of this go. You can duck also if you click oh, in the yeah, stick. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> and grab it with your hands and move it out. <laughs> Vinny, you know you play how you play. I truly you, hate you right now. <laughs> you play how <laughs> <laughs> you want to play. You're porting your bridge. I'm man. leaving behind everything else. <laughs> okay, That's enough. Okay, I ran right at this guy, and I'm still, I still have the option yeah. to shake it off. Uh, but if you really get got, all right, Jan, cut some of this so we can show with the gameplay stuff on the other side. We have seven seconds. <laughs> all right. You've got a blood grenade <laughs> oh, dude. and a very unhappy baby. Oh, the baby freaking out. Very unhappy From baby. The baby losing it out of the controller, I feel like, just encapsulates this whole game. It's ridiculous. Watch as you yeah, get on top oh. of the ladder and do a fucking moon soul. We're, We're just doing shooting. it. Shrek. Just end this Shrek. shit. Shrek. Just end this shit. No. Grinch won. Wow. Damn it. Grinch won. None of us, none of us would have guessed. Yep. You're a mid one, Mr. Did it crash? Did it crash? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yes! You know what I hate? I hate covers of fucking bangers that are fucking slow as shit and dumb. 
So I saw a car commercial that they had uh, the uh, Major Laser song uh, "Lean On." Everybody needs someone to lean on. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. But they did it on like acoustic cover. Like, oh, everybody just needs someone to lean on. That's just the worst. I got a playlist good. full of it. It's garbage. If you want to hate yourself. Chef, do you want your keyboard? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. <laughs> you want yes. trash-ass music. There's so much of that shit on Spotify. If you, you want kids discovering those songs, you, hey, you need to get into off-brand Kids Bop is what you need to do. Because Kids Bop has rules about what they will say about sex and fucking. But if you go to Kids Pop with a P, no law! Pop, huh? Zone Do they say the bad words? No, okay. they have they have they have some law, but there's a cup there's a kid's cover of children singing hot in here. Wow, uh, if you, you listen told to it more this. than twice on Spotify, they will put you in jail. Jail. Thanks, Jeff. Um, oh, some website ran their list of, of like here's the worst songs of the '80s, and, huh. our, and we looked at that list and said this is all bullshit. Huh? And then I think it led to. That, you know, there's some steps in between here, but now here we are. How about... I, I don't know this song, but it's come up enough times, I feel like I have to say it. Temporary Secretary by Paul oh McCartney. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! I love this that song! Might be new number one. I love uh, this song! Wait, 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 wow. wait. This is legitimately Paul McCartney? maybe my least wow. favorite song. I, uh, I don't think I've ever heard, heard this, this song. song for the first time sometime over like the last year or two. I appreciate... Oh no. Pump yeah. it up. Turn, this yeah. song. The lyrics, the vocals is what really Find for me someone strong and sweet. I can't believe ah, it. Ah yes, the oh. voice of the Beatles. Here he is singing for you. Oh my god, put this at number 1. I, this I cannot believe out. I forgot about what this year song. Did this come How out? could he make this song? My partner became obsessed with this song for like Paul McCartney has put out a lot of things. <laughs> is he has some kind of experimental phase yeah, for him. Have we made sure this is a Yeah, it's 1980. I am willing uh, to say get, that this get is to the course. You need to, you need Secretary Temporary Secretary how, how, how is this a How is this a beetle? Right? Yeah. <laughs> how did he make this? Holy oh, shit. I love this song. <laughs> I can't. It's I, I can't. so bad. <laughs> It like the so song will destroy this whole room. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like dial up. <laughs> New yes. number one. New number one. Think about New this. Number one. Think about it though. 1980. This weird synthy song. 1980. Oh. He's he's ahead of his time yet again. But he's doing everything wrong with it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Show me the top of this list, Jan. Man. I would rather listen to this. No, I'd rather, I'd rather listen, listen to, to Lady, Lady in Red. Red. No, <laughs> come the fuck on! I'd rather <laughs> listen to Lady in Red. Lady in Red wasn't done by a Beatle. <laughs> <sighs> in the middle of the street. Why would your house be in the middle of a fucking street? That's the that's, that's the rub. You never fucking know. Isn't that it just is... in the middle of like the block? Yeah, I can't. Uh, I think you are in control. Oh no. no. Cool. This is not bad. Are there microtransactions? Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs> is this one player? How is it that Garfield's both Garfield's eyes are one? <laughs> is this a single player game? Really? There's no multiplayer? How? How you have a single player cart racing? <laughs> that can't be right. I have to be missing it. No, Maybe it's the you're not. Slipper. You have to beat the game before you go You should check the Steam, the Steam store page. Yeah, tell you. yeah. See if there's a nudity tag. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, what the fuck? Why? Why? Why is this on the Garfield Steam page? Ben, why are you enabling these people? We're not. Called classic masterpiece. How do I see the tag? Uh, it should be on the single player. <laughs> <laughs> These motherfuckers really put out a Garfield card game without multiplayer to save you from the despair. Who would you we race pass against? And play? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> I will not participate. 
Folks, it's an honor for me to introduce the next segment of this year's Extra Life live stream festivities here on GiantBomb.com. It's time for what is quite possibly the most highly anticipated late night talk show from a video game website's business guy. From Giant Bomb headquarters in San Francisco, West Coast, it's the late program with Business Day. <laughs> Starring <laughs> Business Day. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Uh, hey. Tonight, oh, wait, you, you were supposed to keep reading. There was no oh, line there. Tonight, Business Day interviews whoever is sitting to his right. I was wrong. Plus. Oh. Plus. The Business Dave Orchestra, a brand new Business Dave Top 10, and of course, the Business Dave Players. Can you go back one frame on your thing? Can you? Look at this. Look. You goatseed a question mark. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, did you hear about the guy that canceled the big Death Stranding pre-order? <gasps> no, no, I haven't. Yeah, it turns out, had racist tweets back in 2007. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <God>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when that was not. That's funny. That's funny. I don't get it. I'll go with that one. Canceled. Oh, thank you for explaining. <laughs> when you ice it for more than 20 minutes, it actually has the <clears throat> opposite of the intended effect. What the fuck? Stop at 20, bro. Then wait and wait another hour, and then hit it again. You know what I'm talking about? A bar? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Number five. Uh -huh. Speaking of it being Asian, this is racist. <laughs> 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 You're gonna have to give me just a second. All right. While I figure this out, our technical analysis is forthcoming. What if we were to just load up our back with as and, much cargo and, and technically see if that if it impacts the game's frame rate? That's, yeah. I like it. Okay. That's a technical analysis that I can get behind. Okay. Hang on here. <laughs> technical analysis video, ten minutes max. Okay. You know, a smarter website would put these up as separate videos so you get two clicks instead of one. But we didn't get where we got today by so thinking smart. <laughs> Start the clock! <laughs> uh, so as you can see here, it's I thought right. uh, <laughs> something like, let's say nine or ten. How many polygons do you figure in that hat? Layers high? Okay. Uh, quite a few, I would say. Okay. All right. Did you know there are more polygons in that hat than were in the entire character model of Solid Snake in the original Metal Gear? Wow. I'm gonna say that's almost definitely true. <laughs> probably. Actually. Even though I know you just made that up, that probably has to be true. How can, you know, who can say? And, uh, I appreciate that. As a fan of technical video games. <laughs> Keeping games with uh, graphics, mm -hmm. for example. Oh yeah, no, th that's, yeah, to use a technical term, graphics yes. are when there are things on the screen you can see with your eyes. I would describe this all as fans of graphics. Uh, yes, I, I'm a graphics fan. It's, uh, I'm, it's maybe not uh, the end all be all, but uh, I think for some people it definitely is. Uh, and for those of you who are like that, welcome to our, our deep our deep technical analysis. Yeah. yeah as now, you if you see. count, if you could count the pixels here, would you say there's like like what more than like a thousand? Like what, how? Oh, I would certainly hope so. Okay, great. Terrific. You'll see the occasional longer 10, 15 seconds, but nothing. Uh... Yeah. Now we we did see a, a previous version of this. Um, in the TGS footage, right. uh, but uh, this didn't feature all of the same textures found here in the uh, domestic release. Good morning, Sam. Blood collection complete. Thank you for your generosity. Oh gosh, I have bad news for you. What the fuck? I'm this sorry. is the stuff from the TGS video. I'm sorry. 